Well, three years have passed since Huawei Cloud, the cloud computing service of Huawei, was set up in South Africa. Here's Angela Coppola now looking back at what the company's done in the last 36 months. The company had been in South Africa for nearly two decades before the cloud offering was launched. Local customers were skeptical at the beginning. There were lots of questions, but that's changed. Huawei Cloud, why uh, uh, we, we trust you and to cooperate with you for the long-term uh, cooperation. So the trust of, from the partner, maybe they concern, are you going to taking my customers? Are you going to uh, stealing my revenue from this marketing? And from the customer, I think they will be concerned if I cooperate with you, if I move my day to you, are you seriously to take care of my business? Three years later, and it's done very well, taking on the big established players. Uh, when we look at Gartner's uh, index of infrastructure as a service providers, uh, we saw that Huawei came out fifth globally, and that's, that's a huge feat compared to Microsoft's Azure, Amazon's web services, and Google Cloud, which are all very established uh, businesses in, in the global market. They've been going since the early 2000s. So Huawei's new entrant into, into the South African market is, is, a, is a huge one. On the consumer side, the company has a big presence in the country, so providing a cloud service made sense. They still have a very, very strong position in this market for being an affordable, trusted provider of electronics in South Africa. So those services are being used in tandem with the hardware that they sell. The company is focused on its business model and providing the digital technology the clients and prospective clients are looking for. We want to continually to build a very sustainable uh, business model. We want to support our uh, local partners uh, to let them feel uh, stronger. And from the technical, from the marketing, from the sales, and everybody needs to know how to use that new technology, use the cloud technology to design something for your customers. I think now the customer is getting smart and smart. They want a new platform to, to be uh, to facing to the futures. If, if the local partner cannot provide that solution, I think they will choose someone else. Cloud computing is not only about providing a service to direct partners and clients, but also their partners and clients. If that process doesn't work properly, everyone suffers. I'm Angelo Coppola for CGTN in Johannesburg, South Africa.